Hello everybody, my name is Caleb Crone, or Astro Crone, and welcome back to the YouTube channel. Tonight is a clear Wednesday night, and tonight we're shooting the Rosette Nebula. While I wait for the Rosette Nebula to rise over the house, I'm going to be shooting the Bubble Nebula, which I've never shot before, along with the Rosette. Never shot both of them, so this is my first time shooting both, and uh, hopefully it goes well. Um, yeah, so join me tonight to shoot the rosette and the bubble. Here we go. It's actually much darker than it looks on the camera, but uh, it's almost uh, polar alignment time. Uh, I've been having a little trouble polar lining with this mount. I have no idea why, but uh, last night went okay, but um, should be good tonight. So once that once Polaris, oops, once Polaris pops out, I'm gonna start the polar alignment and then turn the mount on start the st three star alignment and we're gonna start imaging I'm ready so tonight I'm gonna be shooting with the L extreme filter to uh, to block out that really heavy light pollution I have here in Ontario so um if everything goes well tonight I should have a special photo of the rosette nebula it is my first light so I'm nervous, but I, I'm ready for it. It should be rising soon, actually. Well, not quite. Not quite. Like I said, it's much darker than it is, than you actually see on the camera. Uh, I should be polar lining in about five minutes or so. So, uh, here we go. So I'm actually gonna start my alignment now, actually. We're gonna do a three star alignment. Uh, I'm not plate solving. Capella, perfect. Now we gotta focus on this baby. Yeah, see Capella, we're gonna slew right over there. All right, should be pretty spot on. Okay, I know the lighting is complete ass, but um, I'm doing two minutes on the bubble nebula as I wait for the rosette to rise. It's almost, it's almost over the house, but uh, let me fill you in on what happened tonight. After polar lining, I was doing my three-star alignment, and then I hit my tripod. <laughs> so I had to redo everything. I had to redo the polar alignment, which was even more of a. It was so. It was harder to do it because it was. It was now it's dark, dark. So it was harder to polar align, but it was actually better than the first time I did it which is weird, but now I'm doing two minutes on the, the bubble and the lobster claw and the rest of that beautiful region. And uh, I'm gonna switch to the rosette. So I've just finished uh, shooting the bubble because the rosette should be up by now. Um, I just took my calibration frames for the bubble. I'm about to slew to uh, NGC 2237, I think it is, right? 2237. Let's see. Stupid plane view object, slewing. 
All right. Let's see.